we had a reservation. So when we got over here and we saw that line that's wrapped around the side of the building, we walked over and we were like, um, why did we make a reservation for a walk-up window? Turns out the sit-down door is right underneath the sign right here. It is a sit-down restaurant with the option of a walk-up window. We just had lunch at La Creperie de Paris. We did the sit down side. They do have a, a walk up quick service menu, which is right here. Although that crowd of people standing over there, that's what they're waiting on. <sighs> I'm full. I'm full too. What'd you think? Overall, I did like it. I did realize though, that I do not like buckwheat. <laughs> <laughs> that is what I definitely got from my experience at this restaurant. Unfortunately, that is what their savory crepes are made of because it has on their menu that savory crepes in Brittany are made with buckwheat flour and are called ga galettes. Is that right? I don't speak French. <laughs> so I got the prefix menu, which came with. The prefix menu, it costs $33. It comes with a choice of soup or salad. Choice of one galette with glass of hard cider, soda, or juice, and then a choice of one dessert crepe. And when you add it all up together, it comes out to a very similar price, unless you get one of the alcoholic beverages, which I did not. Kind of depends on what you want to do. So is it worth getting the prefix menu? Sort of. You didn't necessarily like the buckwheat flour that the crepe was made of. You had the ratatouille, but how was the filling? The filling was really good. There was a lot of filling, because what they do is they kind of plop it in the middle and they fold the edges over. It was like a bowl of soup in the middle of that thing. And yours had, the, it was the same thing. I mean, there's mm -hmm. a ton of filling in the middle. So if you can get past the flavor of the buckwheat. I didn't think it was that bad. I do like what I'll call normal crepes better. Like their dessert yeah. crepes were not made with the buckwheat. And, and I think my food would have been better with that stuff. It would have tasted better because I just I couldn't get past that flavor. It was terrible. I ate it all because I paid for he it. He sure did. She was like, I didn't think you were going to eat all that. And he said, I ain't wasted food. That's what he did to me. <laughs> the soup was a potato leek soup. I liked it. I liked it better after you added salt. Oh my God, everything needed salt. Everything needed a lot of salt. Mine didn't need salt. I don't usually like salt, a lot of salt. I dumped the salt shaker over and I'm just like pouring it in the soup because it didn't taste like anything. Once, once we added it though, I really enjoyed it. And that was a massive bowl of soup. It really was. The container is very deceptive until you put the spoon down in it and realize it goes all the way to the bottom of this pedestal bowl. It's a lot of soup. It took me like the entire time to finish it. Obviously we got the soup and didn't get the si side salad, but I did see tables around us that did and it was, it was a decent sized salad as well. I only got um, one savory crepe and then just water. Yeah, mine had cheese, caramelized onion, uh, bacon and ham. What did you think though? Yeah, it was a good experience. I did, I did enjoy it. Overall, you liked it? I liked it. Would you go back? I mean, I probably would, but knowing that you very much disliked the buckwheat. How about this? I would go back, we could go back for dessert. Absolutely. And I would get soup and salad and that kind yeah. of stuff too. Yeah, I mean, I would get another savory crepe. I thought it tasted pretty good, but. I just don't like buckwheat. If you like it, great. You're gonna love it because man, did it taste like it. Just not a, a flavor I enjoy. So it's, just, you know, your personal preference. Have you eaten at La Creperie de Paris here in the France Pavilion at Disney's Epcot? Let us know what you thought in the comments below. Did you eat inside? Did you go to the quick service window? Should we come back again? Try different things? Let us know in the comments below. But until next time, remember, 
No capes. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I don't know why I'm going. Oh, you still have your mask on. Nerd. All right, <laughs> take two. I don't have my mask on anymore. Nerd. Then it comes with a choice of soup or salad. Excuse me. It comes with a... <laughs> Hazards of uh, standing next to a theme park table. No capes. Is that your finger? That was distracting me. Oh, God, that's like... <laughs> I thought that was my arm. <laughs> no kicks!